I can't remember a time I didn't that argue didn't. with Ruth. <laughs> she would, Ruth would start a fight in an empty room. No, that's not true. Not I just stand up for myself. I just well, think you, you don't, don't always have to agree with your partner. People, please, are you're always nice to everybody. They say Ruth's lovely. No, because I am nice. They, they don't, don't have, wind well, me up. they don't up. have to live with you. No, and ditto. <laughs> and ditto. Ditto, they'll go, I'm harder lovely. to live with. Is that your own hair today? No. What? Oh, don't. I'm sorry I asked. I'll take my hair out if you take your teeth out. Oh, come no, on, please. <laughs> Eamon, Eamon, are you there, Eamon? Sarah, oh, yes, you know you've got me on speed dial. <laughs> yeah. Can I not even go to work without no. you butting in? <laughs> you see, <laughs> you see <laughs> Janet, this sums it all up. It's like, Ruth, it's like he's on my show. It's like when I was asked to take part in This Morning all those years ago, 15 years ago, I said, oh, that's a good idea. I said to the producers, Ruth said, well, it's not a good idea. I don't want that happening. This is my show. It's not your show. Yeah. Very territorial. My Very friends. Very territorial. And the thing is, not only are you hijacking my show, as you say, <laughs> but when I have a girl tonight, I have my girlfriends round, Eamon always comes in, he plonks himself down, and they all love him, so he's like, he's hi, charming. girls, oh, your hair looks nice, and chat, chat, chat. And then he gets the look from me. What's the look? Yeah, and he goes, oh, oh I'm getting the look. Oh, she wants <laughs> me to go. And I go, he's waiting for guys. me to go. No, honestly, stay. And I go, yeah, no, I want no, let to me go. Tell you. Let me tell you why oh. that is. Because if you've ever seen that film Misery with James Caan and Martin <laughs> Burke, right? She keeps me in that house. I'm not allowed to have anybody, any of my friends visit. It You're can only friends. be her so friends. Mine. None <laughs> of you will friend. have ever been to our house because not through me. I would have you all there. <laughs> Often they, you know, fathers faint and they step over them, don't they? Because they're like, sorry, guys, but <laughs> this is not your moment. Yeah, I understand that, no, that someone's at your, work. It is your moment. First of all, I just want to say midwives. Yeah. yeah. The second thing I would say, if it's not our moment, why did you insist that the door was bolted and I was locked inside the room? Because <laughs> you kept going out visiting all the nurses and the women in other rooms. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Joe, that's not spe speaking true. That's true. There were requests coming true. in from the general ward that people wanted to meet me. Yeah. <laughs> so, so that. Was, I wasn't denying. Yeah. I literally, at one point, I was lying like that. I was having a little moment in between contractions. You know, it was just like a little quiet moment. I thought, you'll get going in a minute. And then the door opened and I said, Eamon, would you mind coming and saying hello to and Mrs Brown jealous. in room you got three. jealous. You got jealous. You got jealous, didn't you? And he went. And he went. And then the next contraction came and like, I suddenly went, get him back in! <laughs> <laughs> there he is in makeup, all alone. Thank you. You're right, darling. What's the pleasure bit we're mixing? <laughs> 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 What? You know you love working with me. Stop pretending. You're so bossy. Is that the word? <laughs> I can cut you off now. I have the power. This is very, a bit strange, isn't it? Why? Kind of introducing you like a guest. Do you not Just... think it's a bit strange? No. Oh. That's strange. <laughs> See, her trouble, her trouble is she gets nervous in a TV studio, right? So she gets... She's always dictating yeah. what happens <laughs> and likes to be in control. Now she sees me and she thinks he could say anything. He's got that option. <laughs> Just treat me as if it's like at home. But with disdain. Oh. With disdain. <laughs> Just tell me what to do. Um, you I know, think Ruth is couple. better at concealing the crossness when you have your little <laughs> things. I think you're a little yes. bit more... Um, it's quite clearer on your she face. She does that in reverse. She's, she's the one that speaks to me with disdain the way she does in everyday life. <laughs> Whereas I, you know, I'm being quite senior in the business. I'm used to saying things Old. and things happen. <laughs> but with Ruth, who died and put you in charge? <laughs> but we know what her secret is. She stands behind that cookery bench thing that we do, right? And she stands there. You know this well, Nadia. Yeah. And she lifts her heel and she scrapes down the front of my shoe <laughs> and then puts her stiletto right into my if he's been, <laughs> if he's been, does she? If he's been annoying me, I think, oh, you wait, because we've got cookery soon, and I just do that. Because it's funny, because we can all tell, can't yeah. oh, we? we can. know. Oh, look, Ruth's a bit annoyed. Is, is that? Is that <laughs> nail polish? Have you just put nail polish on my head? Well. Not yet. I have no idea. What's what that? is it, seriously? I think, I think is it's it nail polish bit, or is yeah. it...? No, it's not. It's a liquid lip. It's almost like oh, a is piece it? of art, oh, isn't oh, it? Oh, right. Here you go, my darling, just like that. Putting blusher under my chin. What? I don't know. Or do you just put it on your cheeks so when you blush? Is that what it's for? Yeah, I guess so. Right, well, well, you're doing that on purpose now. I feel you've gone over you the would line. You stop talking. I do live. <laughs> my job. <laughs> you're so cute, honestly. <laughs>
All right, here we go. Here's, Not my, right. here's my before. <laughs> There's my before. And here's me now. Oh, Ruth, I love it. <laughs> that is classic. I maybe I, I should have got, got a bit harder. Right um, if you'd have stopped talking, it would have been fine. You just said too much talking during all that. You were that. doing that on that purpose. That is classic. Well, you get quite like it teeth. now. I said, of all the years Amy and I have been together, we have never, how can I say that politely, broken wind I just intentionally. Think... I mean, I've, you know, I've heard the odd little one that's... We had the odd out. accident. <laughs> <laughs> never, ever, ever in a million years would in you have seen years. me lift my leg and let one rip. <laughs> I don't even like that He doesn't even like me saying... I don't like let, lavatorial humour. And rip. I don't like no. the F word. No. And, uh, no, no. Not so that F word. He not likes the that other one. one. <laughs> um, so, yeah. so, um, That's true, then. Absolutely true. That's absolutely true. Absolutely true. And people wow. seem to be astonished by that at the time when I just... Oh, it's like people who watch that. each other go to the loo and all sorts oh, of things. Oh, no. you should live with Stacey. <laughs> <laughs> 25% of people say I love you to their partner several times a day, not just once. Well, I do. You do, actually. Yeah. He does say it. And then I said also say it to you as well. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> our life, you've got to walk a mile in somebody's shoes because people idealise and say, well, they're a lovely couple, that's wonderful, that's wonderful. But we don't know, and I just think... Okay. I think you can't judge people. If it happened to one of my kids... Well, I was just going to say, I let me ask you then. I would be there to support them, but I wouldn't be there to be judgmental. Right, so I'm, that's what I was going to okay. say. So, one of your sons is married. So, if you knew... Oh, no, that's if that, some, that, no, but, but I've look, got to ask you... Let's apply it to all No, children. no, you've got to apply it to yourself. So, if somebody <laughs> told you your son... None of my business. ..was cheating on his wife... None of my business. So, you'd say nothing... None of my... He's, he's 30 years of age. You wouldn't talk to him about it at all? It's none or of my business. Say, if he came to problem? me to talk to me, I would talk to him about it, but otherwise I don't see how it's And if you talked to him about Maybe it... Maybe he should talk to me about my marriage. See? Yeah, you wouldn't like that, would you? Well, I'm just saying, it's if if he did come to you, what do you think your advice would be? Would you say my Look, advice would be, be what would this? keep him happy and not cause undue hurt to others? Cheers, Eamon. Yeah, thanks for that. <laughs> Look, I did one. Look, it's got hearts. No, I can't read it now because it's really quite gushy for me. Oh, go on. Oh, no, just a little bit. All right, my darling. We are always so busy. I worry I don't take time to tell you how much I love you. Oh. Well, I love you more than you will ever know. You make my life complete and give me the love and support to do everything I do. Thank you for making me feel like the most loved woman in the world. Oh, oh. oh so nice! Oh. Amen, oh. take Amen. 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 I don't do. Gu I don't normally do gushy things like that. He's the. I That's call so him my lovely. poet. He's the gusher. He's too busy eating melon fingers. Melon fingers. Yeah, Sarah. Am I jealous, Janet? No. No. <laughs> <laughs>